Well, Jeannie's Cleaning, helping cancer patients in the Kalamazoo area. This week is Cleaning for Cancer Week, but this is something Jeannie does year-round, partnering with the organization Cleaning for a Reason. Now, she serves at least two patients a month, starting with two free cleans and a discount on services after all of that. So if you are a current cancer patient in the Kalamazoo area or know of someone who would like some help, you can contact Jeannie's Cleaning directly. Also this morning, the Salvation Army is getting a head start on fundraising for the holiday season. Their Rescue Christmas and Rescue Thanksgiving campaigns begin next month. Families in need of a meal or those interested in volunteering will be able to sign up beginning Monday, November 2nd. Of course, the Muskegon location isn't the only one in need of extra hands and donations ahead of the holidays. To learn more, head to SalvationArmyUSA.org. The Bob in downtown Grand Rapids is hosting a mask arrayed ball on Halloween night. The event will include live music, a costume contest, and cash prizes. However, there will be no dancing, and all guests will be required to wear a mask at all times. Other social distancing rules will also be in place. Guests will be able to enjoy live DJ performances in four venues and have the opportunity to vote on best costume. For more information, visit thebob.com. Today is the deadline to help. Kids Food Basket is collecting decorated brown bags and they're hoping you can drop one off by today. Now it's all part of their 11th annual brown bag decorating day, giving brown bags filled with food to children with food insecurities. The fundraiser began October 1st and comes to an end today. The organization was hoping to collect 100,000 brown bags this year, but as of this morning, they are still a little short of that goal. So help them out. To find out more about what you can do, head to kidsfoodbasket.org. If necessary, listen up. The NFL says the Super Bowl could be pushed back to March. Holding the big game on March 7th could come into play if teams continue to experience COVID outbreaks or if the league has to shut down completely. Several teams have already had games postponed as players have tested positive. However, the NFL says it is doing everything it can to make sure the championship is played on its scheduled date, February 7th.